What's up guys? Moneyman1212 here. And today, I'm going to just talk about the Nintendo Direct that literally just happened last night. Obviously, I wasn't able to stream my reaction to it. So, I thought I'd just give somewhat of an in-game analysis slash my thoughts about what games I'm going to get and everything. So, first of all, they announced Luigi's Mansion 3 in 2019. Which we can just skip some of this. But yeah, and then they... About Luigi's Mansion 3, that game looks really fun. I haven't played the original game, but it looks very fun. But I'll definitely be getting that game when it comes out. Um, Kirby's Super Epic Yarn, I think that's called. Extra Epic Yarn. I'm not getting, guys. I don't know. Um, for this, I thought they were making a Bowser Jr. game. Like, when I first saw this last night, I thought that they were making a game based on Bowser Jr. And I, th I was, like, super excited, but then I saw it was just Mario and Luigi, and I was like, okay, guys, that that's okay, but I mean. And this I was hyped about, too. Luigi's Mansion for the 3DS, because, I don't know, it looks fun. Like I said, I haven't played the original game, but obviously it looks fun. And honestly, originally when I first watched it, it just, this direct felt a bit underwhelming compared to other ones. But now looking back at it, I really, I like some of the things that they're announcing and I think I'll actually enjoy most of them. Oh yeah, we don't even acknowledge them on this channel and let's go back a bit because... I just skipped that 3DS part, but yeah, now we're going on to the Nintendo Switch, which obviously I liked a lot of these releases. Splatoon 2 update, I'm still a bit confused on what exactly they really released. This is just like some more free content or more Octoling stuff, whatever it is, I like I mean, the stuff that they're doing is pretty good. Okay, Mega Man 11. This looks like a fun platformer that I'd most likely play. I mean, I've played a few of the Mega Man games. Although, they're not my favorite, but they're definitely fun games that I'd try. I mean, I'll definitely try the uh, demo of that of the Mega Man game that's on the eShop right now. I forget. This is the new update now for Mario Tennis Aces, a game that I am willing to get very soon. Because a lot of this new content looks pretty cool. And I definitely want to get. Like, you can get alternate colors and hats and stuff. I mean, it's not much. And then this is a Capcom beat-em-up um, medley? I don't know. It's just multiple games from Capcom. Not much there of my interest. This game, if any of you guys have been watching my channel at all, I do not have a Wii U. And this game is one of the the games that I've wanted to play for a while. Because it lo even though, I mean, it's the same old formula of New Super Mario Bros. I've played a lot of them. But, I mean, I like what they're doing with the Switch. They're porting all of over all the games, because for people like me that didn't buy a Wii U, that skipped over that generation and just had a Wii, I mean, it gives me so many more games that I want to play, and, you know, new Super Luigi U, but dude, that's coming out in January, and I'm like, eh, we're just gonna skip over this. This game, um, looks pretty weird. Oh, and now they're talking about the Nintendo Switch Online service. Something I'm going to have to start paying for very soon if I want to keep making videos. Probably by next weekend I'll have to start paying, since this is the day after. I'm just going to skip over this because, guys, you know what it is. It's just an online service. Besides those controllers. Now, those controllers, I'm going to buy, like, 94%, I say. Oh, Luigi's, um, Nintendo Switch gets oofed by the Thwomp. That was pretty funny. Let's go, though. I like the app. I'll try out the app. And I'm intrigued by bonuses. They could mean SNES, N64 games, possibly even GameCube games is what I'm thinking. 
But yeah, guys, I'm just going to get the early plan because I'm the only one that plays on my Nintendo Switch. So, let's see them. Let's see them, boys. See, they look like some pretty cool controllers that I'd like to play vintage games. But there's another controller that I'm even more interested in, if you know me. So, guys, let's skip a bit more. Let's go, Eevee, and let's go, Pikachu. This game, I am also, even though I haven't played as much Pokemon in the past months, I'm pretty hyped for this game, even though I'm like, it's just a Gen 1 remake. It looks like a fun game that I'm sure I'd enjoy. And I know there's no more HM slaves. I like that. Finally, I can use my B Barrel, even though B Barrel won't be in the game. Rip. Oh, yeah, and I found this one really funny. Ready, guys? Flying Pikachu. J just think that over for a, for a while. A flying Pikachu. Yeah. Pretty funny, guys. <laughs> but yeah, I thought that was pretty funny. And there's not much more because I'm not going to buy a new Switch just to get it. And we can skip over Diablo 3. I don't think I'm going to be playing that. Let's just get it out of here. Okay. But, yeah. Now, what do we have? We have Super Mario Party, a game that I am also extremely hyped for. And probably will get very close to its release date, because why not? I like how there's online to it, and it's coming out, like, October 2nd, I think it is. Here, let's watch this. Yeah, like, this is the online service. This looks, like, really cool. October 5th. I was close. There is a new Pokemon game. I'm confused with this game. Is this just like an RPG? Or is this like a game supposed to be like Pokemon, but you're controlling people? It could be a good game. Probably won't buy it, though. Just because... I don't know, guys. But this game this is basically just SimCity. For the Nintendo Switch, it, it's what it, from it looks like. Because you get to build roads, you get to build your own town. Which, I mean, it actually looks pretty fun. <laughs> I don't know if this is what actually interests me compared to all the other games on it, but I don't know why. It just looks like an okay game. And let's see. Eh, no thanks. Let's just skip over this. But yeah, we're almost done the direct. <laughs> It definitely took me longer than, or less time than I thought it would. It feels like time's just flying by. And oh, this game. I have very mixed feelings about this game. This is one of the reasons why I was underwhelmed about it originally. Because I'm like, really? Darn Yoshi, you give more time than... You give all these third-party games, and games that I don't really want to hear about, more time than Smash Bros? But... Now looking at this game again, really in depth, it looks like a really, it looks like a fun enough game for me to buy, and I mean, it it'll it'll be okay, at least I hope. I mean, I'm guessing it'll be okay. But yeah, you can play the level backwards. Why can't you do that in Mario Kart Nintendo? Come on, giving you a hint, boost you up. So many sales, guys. And these are some tabletop games, um, basically card games. The only one I'm excited for is Catan, Settlers of Catan. I like that game as a board game. See? Ready? We Ready? Come on, come on, Nintendo. Okay, there you go. Catan. Um, what is this game again? Um, I forget. Oh, it's the Civilization game. I'm like, I probably won't buy it. Doesn't look like a terrible game, though. So if you want it, get it. Star Fox, guys. New Star Fox game. Never played, oh, I've played a bit of Star Fox games. But yes. Come on, guys. New school Star Fox. I'm hoping it'll be good. But I mean, and even Nintendo, they said, do a barrel roll. In their direct. So, you know, it has to be good. And there's Wolf looking pretty good in HD. 
Also good in Smash Bros. More RPGs. I'm not a huge fan of RPGs. So I'm just gonna skip past this. See it. I'm not a huge fan of them. So let's just please. Please. Okay, there are a lot of games here. Like, there's Just Dance. I mean, I used to like those games. Why? Um, this game actually looks okay. I don't know. I mean, I've never seen it before, but it looks okay. Just Dance, I'm not going to be getting. FIFA, I mean, I friends that play FIFA, but I don't know. NBA 2K19, I'm not a big basketball fan, so... Uh, nah, nah. And there we go. A million and a half Final Fantasies are coming to the Nintendo Switch. Which, I've never played it, because it's RPG. I'm not a huge fan of RPGs. But I'm sure for the Final Fantasy fan out there, they are dying. Because there's Final Fantasy 7, Final Fantasy 8, Final Fantasy like 10-2 or something like that. There's every single Final Fantasy that I think I could name on this. And I mean, the graphics don't look that bad, so I'd say... That they're safe games. There are some good games. And here we go. My favorite part. Although this is was underwhelming at the time. <sighs> okay, we have the Nintendo Switch. I'm not, I, dude. This I would. It, it looks really good. I have to say, it looks amazing. So does this. And guys. I mean, why not? That looks pretty cool. November 2nd. But guys, look what else we can get November 2nd. I know I'm like yelling, but this was my favorite part of the whole entire Nintendo Direct. Is that you can finally get this controller. Again. Because this controller, as you can see, the, the date on the back is basically this controller the one that I bought is most likely from 2004 to 5. I mean, it could be anywhere from like 2002 to 2005, really. So I'm super happy to be, have official Nintendo controllers that don't cost $100 back when I'm in t Smash Bros. And Nintendo consoles in general, because there was a gap where I didn't have the newest console, the Wii U. But I'm not <laughs> regretting that, because obviously the Switch is a million times better. And then... Guys, you see that name right there? You see, you see that name right there? It could be Waluigi. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. But no. Here you go, guys. All Animal Crossing fans. And enjoy. I mean, she's a new fighter anyway. So, it, I mean, I, I can't complain. It's a new character. So, so I mean, that's cool. I, I'm cool with any new characters. Although, I still want Waluigi. Even though he's not in there. I mean, who doesn't want Waluigi? And then, Animal Crossing fans literally get, like, the biggest surprise ever. I mean, if you want me to speculate on her moveset, I mean, I'm not a competitive player yet. But, I mean, I could try to do it. And, oh boy. This is... <laughs> Here you go, Animal Crossing fans. Let's just, let's just skip it. Because I think y'all know, I think you all know what I, what they're going to announce now. Tom Nook for Smash, no, just kidding. No. Here you go, guys. Animal Crossing on the Switch. I've never played an Animal Crossing game, but I'll try it out. I mean, why not? But yeah, guys, this is the end of the video. If you did like it, please leave a comment. In the comment section below like the video and of course subscribe for more content guys peace out